the lottery. Its scratch cards are known to most Americans. You buy one and scratch it off. It's never been hacked despite 45 states having one and billions of dollars at stake. Now, imagine an election system based on the same familiar, easy to use, and unhackable system. This is the premise of Reedy Voting. A simple to understand, universally accessible, and completely secure method for conducting elections. Elections that are free from real or perceived irregularities. Elections that increase access so that every eligible voter can ensure that their voice is heard. Elections that won or lost on election day, not via recounts and lawsuits after election day. Here's how it works. All a legally registered voter needs is their activated ballot scratch off card, a computer or phone with a camera, and an internet connected web browser. Polling places or libraries can provide the devices. Or the voter can vote remotely using their own device, or even a borrowed one. It doesn't matter. The process starts with the scratch off ballot. The ballots are numbered and serialized, and each is unique. They are produced at the same highly secure, state-of-the-art printing facilities from which we get scratch-off lottery cards, U.S. passports, and other government documents. This document printing process is unbreakable and unfakeable. A voter can pick up a ballot card wherever a state wants. It could be a government office or a retailer. All that is required is that the location has a scanner and a credit card payment system. No, the voter isn't charged anything and doesn't need a credit card, but the credit card system allows for driver license or other IDs to be scanned and matched to the state ID system. Scanning helps transfer the ownership of the ballot card to the voter. Chain of custody is known every step of the way. More specifically, a voter enters the facility and requests a ballot. The attendant asks for identification such as driver's license or state-issued ID. The attendant scratches off the rectangular pad under the state seal to reveal a barcode and scans it with the same scanner used in their existing transaction infrastructure. The attendant scans the barcode on the back of the voter's driver's license or state ID. The ballot is now associated with that voter and that voter only. The voter keeps it if the voter loses their card, no problem. The voter can obtain another ballot card and the new one is registered to them and the old one is rendered useless. On election day, the voter scratches off the first square on the ballot. A QR code is revealed. Holding the phone's or computer's camera to the QR code takes the voter to their personal registration information on the statesecure.gov website. When the voter hits submit, all personal registration data is wiped from the browser and is encrypted into an irreversible, secure, one-way hash. This hash is unique to the individualized ballot card. From the first registration onward, all transactions are encrypted with the hash. The voter's identification cannot be unmasked. The voter then scratches off the second box on the ballot and points the camera at it. The voter's local ballot slate for that jurisdiction in which they live is then revealed. They don't have to be physically located in their home jurisdiction at the time they vote. It's tied to their address as it is today. Absentee balloting just got a whole lot easier. The voter votes and clicks submit. The ballot is again encrypted with the same anonymous one-way secure hash and transmitted directly to a secure digital state repository in the secure .gov server for tabulation once the polls close. Voting is complete. Easily done. No expensive voting booths or software. Voting from anywhere. Those traveling or physically unable to get to the polls still vote securely. The third scratch off pad on the ballot card reveals a third QR code that gives the voter exclusive access to a printable PDF of their ballot. The voter can keep this forever and it further confirms that their vote was accurately cast and recorded. The voter has the only copy of this QR code, so they are the only ones with access. But now, now it gets really cool. That secure digital state repository on the .gov server where the votes go, well, it's being watched by a lot of people, government officials, law enforcement agencies, 
party representatives, news organizations, anyone to whom the state government wants to give access can watch the returns come in in real time. The trick is that because the votes are both anonymous and encrypted, the only thing to watch is that they all come in and none of them leave. As soon as the polls close, the state's Secretary of State runs certification tests to make sure that the vote is complete. The Secretary of State then publishes the encryption key and every agency granted access to the repository can run its tabulation programs at the same time. Everyone will come up with the same total and the uncontestable outcomes are known almost immediately. And there we have it. Voting that's easy, secure, accessible. Reedy Voting offers a 100% verifiable, unbroken chain of custody from ballot activation to the end of the election. Only valid activated registrations can vote, and each valid activated registration can only vote once. Reedy Voting is 100% audible in real time. It offers a 100% transparent process. It is 100% accurate with mathematically provable results immediately. It's time to make our voting process trustworthy again. Redo voting for elections that unite.